Coconuts are so prevalent in Tanzania. We knew that it would be a good idea to create a coconut oil press so that coconut oil could be extracted for domestic use or to sell. Most of the cooking oil is not made in Africa. But here they are, they have all of these coconuts sitting on the ground on the coast there. A group of BYU mechanical engineering students traveled to Tanzania, Africa to implement a coconut oil press system that we had been working on for two semesters. You start with the coconuts that are dehusked and then the coconuts are grated and then that grated meat is placed on top of the oven where you can use the coconut husks and even the shells to burn as fuel to heat the plate of the oven. And you place the coconut meat inside the cylinder and then you put the cylinder inside the press and that squeezes the coconut so that the oil can seep out. When that first press of oil came out, they were just just astonished. They were so surprised that, that we had come up with something that really worked and that it was so fast. The Pope Foundation, who's the humanitarian foundation that sponsored us, they are aiming this toward women that are trying to work themselves out of poverty. They make about two dollars a day and we estimated that they can make about eight to ten dollars a day with this oil. The greatest part about the project was that we were able to use our engineering background to design something for people that were in great need. It just felt so good to see the project come to fruition, you know, to have it come all the way to the end, to see all of their hard work right there working in Africa was just fantastic. It made the biggest difference to see how much potential it has to make a big impact for them and for future generations.